All right, so we're gonna let this go through and we're gonna play the video. Hello everyone. Now that we are done Xenogears, I am moving on to Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2. This game should be fairly quick, uh, quick to get through. It's not that uh, long of a game. It's a pretty fun game. I like this one. <laughs> Trying to fire up your gases. Attention all proud warriors. Have you ever considered joining Time Patrol? As a Time Patroller, you'll prevent history from being changed. Our duty is to protect everyone's memories and help return history to the way it should be. But we need your help. The only requirements are confidence in your capabilities. And of course, a strong desire to protect history. We've got a school for honing your skills and a fully equipped item shop. How about it? Why not use your strength to help out a great cause? <clears throat> We're always on the lookout for powerful warriors. Okay then, listen carefully. To maintain safety here, in Kanzan City, home to the Time Patrol, there are a few rules you must keep. <laughs> First, firing a Kamehameha within city limits is prohibited. Time patrollers wishing to fly when not on duty are required to obtain a flying license. Please help keep Canton City safe by obeying its traffic laws. Lastly, any alteration of history is a grave offense. Our missions come with the risk of changing history. <laughs> So you must exercise the utmost caution. Avoid making changes to history like Trunks did. Keeping these things in mind, please carry out your mission safely. For the sake of the world and its history, we, we look, look forward, forward to welcoming, welcoming each of you to, to the, the Time, Time Patrol. Patrol. Wait, wait, Jake, don't yet. Who's gonna read through 29 pages of this? Are you kidding me? I don't care about the single player lobby, that's fine. I just signed away my life, I'm afraid. So this time around, we're not making a Majin. Oh, oh shit, I gotta follow. I need to choose someone for that special mission. It's Rays! Welcome to the community! Thank you for following. I really appreciate it. Welcome to the community. We got a great bunch of people here. Who should I choose? So we're not making a Majin this time. If you repeatedly unjustly disconnect from online battles, the following penalty will apply. When penalize your character name and online it will appear red waiting rooms. In order to remove your penalty, just continually play online battle into normal completion. This will not work with them. okay. In case you're wondering, I deleted my save file for this on purpose. It's been uploaded. So we can make an Earthling, a Saiyan. Okay, uh, we're not making a Majin, but they have high defense with slow stamina recovery. Defense bonus for stamina is max. Stats differ by gender. A warrior tribe that has low health, but high attack power. Attack power rises when health is low. And all stats arise after reviving. Balanced stats for both offense and defense. Key refills automatically and attack rises when maxed. Low attack and high health and stamina refills quickly. Items are more effective than other races, and health is regenerated when low. This is Namekian. And the Freezer race. I like how they just call them the Freezer race. This race can overpower enemies with their fast movement, but they have low health. The stamina recovers while attacking, and their movement speed increases as their health lowers. You want Earthling? I was gonna make a Saiyan. I was gonna make Miro a Saiyan. No, the character's gonna be named Miro. Alright guys, 
comes down to it then. Do you want Saiyan or human? Or Earthling? Okay, saying it is. So we got a four choice. If we get really, really short, second, medium, or, or really, really tall. I'm just saying. Ha <laughs> ha! This one's always kind of been Miro, in my opinion. So you get bulky, middle, or very slender. What do you think? Lola fell saying, if only. That one? Okay. Head and hair. Look at this. Well, we found my hair. Type 31, remember that. Oh, jeez. Hmm. I don't really want the Rand fan hair. Lodge hair. The Vidal hair. Android 18 hair. More Vidal hair. Go on, hair. Yamcha hair. Android 17. Okay, thanks, thanks. I appreciate that. Marion hair. Ah, reverse Android 18. Looks like another Vidal type hair. Android 17 again. Actually, I think that's probably Super 17. There we go. Mural with a ba with with a bandana. That's kind of a nice hairstyle. The fuck is that? There you go. Chi Chi hair. Vanilla hair. Naturally, this is gonna be it. Huh, these just changed the eyelash length. No. That's very Dragon Ball. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm not Brock. <laughs> Type 4 is okay. I like that. That's not hair. That was an animal of some kind. Yeah. What do you think, type 4? Two or four? What do you guys think, two or four? <laughs> we did four of the lulls the first game. Let's do a somewhat serious character this time. Type 4? Okay, we got two for four. Pupils! What do you think? 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 30. I kind of like 25 or 26 myself. You know what, 30? Oh, 30 is pretty good. What do you guys think? 25, 26, or 30? We got one for 30. It's 30, it's 26, and 25. Yeah, one for 26, one for 30. Twenty-six it is. Okay. We got nose. This is type one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven and eight. What do you think? 
36 may are better. Well, unfortunately, people voted 26. So we'll go with 26. You like type 8? Mouth and jaw. What? I don't like any of these. She just looks angry in 15. I feel like number two is the most mirror here. Maybe five. Yeah, number two feels like the most mirror. Mirror doesn't wear lipstick. You have 15? Okay. Let's go with ears. Unfortunately, we can't really see the ears in this hairstyle, so. There you go. So do we want large, normal size ears, large ears, small ears, or extra large ears? Okay, Wintrigue, fine, we'll do eyes 30. Small. All right, guys. There we go. All right. Green. No. Mira's. Oh, jeez. Mouth is two. Okay, hang on. There we go. You can have a variety of different shades here, but uh, Mira's always had uh, either straight black hair or brown hair. What do you guys think? I could go with other colors if you guys prefer, but Mira's always been black or brown. You want dark purple? Like this? That's... or like this? This one? This one? Or the one that's already on? Alright, we'll drop this one then. Eye color. I usually just give her brown eyes, but what do you think? Should we give her a special eye color? Can we, should we make her Anson? Make her Super Saiyan 3. Alright, we'll go with orange. Upper body. What do you think? Do you like? I like. That's not on purpose.
Hey, black gloves or red gloves? What do you think? Black gloves? Like that? Excellent! Thanks guys! Obviously, we should just name her Patroller. Hmm. That's not very Miro. That's better. Okay. That's not very Miro. That's not very Miro either. That's okay. That's not very mirror either. Alright, so I like two, three, six is okay, and eight. What do you guys think? Take this. What do you guys think? Oh, actually, there might be more. Actually, I really like nine. I really like nine. No. So what do you guys think? We got two for nine. Wendrick, what do you think? Do you like nine? I like nine. You like six better than nine? What do you guys think? We got another one for nine. So anybody want to swap to six? Because right now I got four for nine and one for six. Aw, <laughs> we're gonna go with nine. <laughs> 15 sounds like a six sounds like a chicken. <laughs> You guys are great. This is the 
last time I gaze upon this planet. Come to me. I will change the future! Fuck up, Ramon. Legendary Super Saiyan has shown up. How very unsavory. Allow me to continue my vengeance. This... this will change everything! Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2! So it should fit you like a glove compared to the old stuff. Compared to his current right? outfit? I made some state-of-the-art armor for my hard-working husband who doesn't even have a real job. I'm such a caring wife, aren't I? Oh, come on. Ugh, every day it's training, training, training. Are all Saiyans like this? For goodness sake. Ugh, you really know how to tick me off. Maybe I should just throw a huge birthday party. Not that it's anyone's birthday. What? One incoming report. Upon assessment of the situation, I have concluded that... Just wait one minute. What, what, what was that for? You've been specifically chosen for that critical mission. Now go out there and do it. Okay! And yes, his current outfit really hugged his ass. I'm not entirely certain why I was spying on Vegeta there, but... Okay. Maybe I was spying on Bulma and Vegeta happened to be there.
Prince Davy 97 thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community. We've got a great bunch of people here, so if you want to chat, just make sure you do so. Uh, or just like, it's fine. What the hell's with that face? Chosen for that big mission. Congrats. Oh, cheer up. The Supreme Kai of Time has graciously appeared to give you her best wishes after all. I mean, really. Don't you think you're being a bit cold? Oh, so you're looking for the old man. When he heard you passed the test, he went off somewhere in a hurry. Why don't you go and look for him? You know what? I'm pretty sure that he was the happiest to hear about your success. Toki Toki? The name of the owl is uh, Toki Toki. He's, um... He, he's the basically the controller of time. Guys, I've been really excited to play this for you. I really enjoyed Xeno's uh, verse 2. I only have one major complaint about the game. And I'm not going to tell you what that is. Until later. The old man ran off that way. He may have headed for that building over there at the light blue roof. Somebody must have seen something. You should try asking around. Hurry up now, there's no time to waste. Oh, that reminds me. Even if you're in a hurry, you can't use flight yet. I saw you flying about. Don't make me warn you again. It's dangerous to be out there flying recklessly like that. You need to get your flying license where you can fly in Canton City. All right. New version, Frieza Siege Event has been added. While you're playing online, sometimes the Frieza voice will attack Canton City out of the blue. Alright, well, well we'll experience that later. Um, How are you? Come here to check important information about missions. If you're ever in doubt, give me a shout. What would you like to know about? Nothing, go here. Fuck off, stop talking to me. Tufu. Hey, how you doing? Something the matter? You're looking for the Elder Kai? He was walking down this road just a little bit ago, but he suddenly let out a large gel and took off. Do you know the clothing shop over there? He went down the road just past it. Ask anyone around over there if you can't find him. Somebody must have seen where he went. He's usually quite a boisterous old man, but he seemed a bit exhausted today. I wonder what happened. Okay, Wintree. Thank you for coming to hang out. Chicory. Hello. Why are you wandering about like that? Oh, let me guess, you're looking for the Elder Kai. I saw him walking down the road yelling out that he was busy. I thought he was heading for the academy, but he suddenly took off running towards the reception area. But he fell over. I hope he's alright. That was a pretty nasty spill. The reception area is just below that large yellow roof over there. You should be able to find it on your map. Look at that jump. I keep thinking the sound is delayed, but it's not actually delayed. It just seems that way for me. What is this? Alright guys. I'm gonna stop this. 